this Monday morning. I really need to get up. I've already got up once this morning, but after breakfast, I decided to get back into bed, which was really quite stupid, actually. Speaking of breakfast, we've got this new food company at school, and it is now really, really nice. As in, the whole setup's changed. It now kind of resembles a hotel buffet. You know what? I'll just show you tomorrow morning. Anyway, I actually need to get up and get dressed because I've got a tutorial in about five minutes. School's changed a bit since the last time I showed you a week because some people couldn't get back. So they're kind of having to run an online school as well as normal school. Actually, the only thing that I have to do online is my registration in the morning, which is at 8.30. And I basically just have to say, I'm awake. <laughs> I've only got four lessons a day, which is really good. Actually, four sounds like quite a lot, but they've been moved to 35 minutes each, so it's easier for people online, which is really quite ideal. Anyway, I need to go because I'm not allowed my phone out. Au nord de Marseille, le marché d'intérêt national. Ici, transit chez les gars. <laughs> 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 I'm back from lessons. They were actually okay. I mean, this new 35 minute thing is a game changer. I really don't know how I used to sit through 50 minutes of a lesson. These seem kind of short, but they're definitely long enough. Anyway, I'm back in my house for lunch. I don't know what we're getting, but I've got very high expectations from breakfast. So I'm really hoping it's nice. We got chicken pie and vegetables. It was okay. I mean, nothing special. It kind of seems like this catering company's only come for breakfast because that meal really did resemble the food we got last term, but oh well. Anyway, this afternoon, I'm literally just gonna sit in bed or work i really need to work actually i've been so unproductive but yeah i don't have any lessons or sports so it's my decision what i do which is really quite nice but i'll update you if i do anything actually exciting i've got posts i literally never get posts when i'm at school so when i do it puts me in a really good mood the first thing i got are these jeans which i actually bought myself i tried them on and they fit quite well but they are pretty bright Oh well. And then I got these rings from Maisie Moo Rings on Instagram. They're actually really cool. I'm becoming obsessed with green and this has really fed my addiction. Anyway, I need to go and work. It's got to 5.30 and I still haven't started. I'm just getting ready for bed. It's only 9.30, but I'm actually really tired and I don't know why. I think it's because school generally is quite tiring because I actually have done nothing today. I went for a walk with my friends before supper, which was really nice. But other than that, literally nothing. And it's weird because I thought Mondays were renowned for being the busiest day of the week. But for me, they're just pretty boring. I promise my week does get a bit more exciting. Anyway, I'm gonna finish getting ready and then I'm gonna get into bed. Morning, it's time for breakfast. Right, first you pick up your tray and then come over here and this is like the hot plates, there's sausages and pastries. That stuff kind of changes every day. And then we've got cereal and a toaster machine. And then you can't actually see, but there's yogurt with granola and all the toppings to put on. That bit's my favorite bit. And then moving over here, you have the, all the drinks. And I am ready. Sorry, I've been in a massive rush this morning and I'm actually running late for my lessons, so I really need to go. But do you see what I mean about breakfast, how it kind of looks like a hotel buffet? It might just be me, but I'm pretty sure it does. Right, I actually need to go because I've got lessons. To be fair though, you know when you start running late, it gets to a point where I'm like, oh, I'm already late, it doesn't matter, which is a really bad quality. I need to snap out of it. Right, I need to go. I'm just on my way back to house now. I am starving. For break, we got given these waffles. You know the ones with like all the sugar lumps in? I don't really know how to describe them. They were quite nice, but I'm not really feeling satisfied. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go to the kitchen and make something. It's only an hour until lunch. So I was just planning on having a coffee and some toast. Came into our kitchen. There's no milk, there's no butter, and there's no bread. I know I might be seeming really dramatic, but people who go to boarding school will feel my pain. Anyway, I'm actually in a PR now, so I'm gonna go and do some work and enjoy my coffee. Wow. Steph, yeah. what time's football? Three o'clock. Look at her room, actually. She's head of house, so it's like three times the size of all the others. Hi. That's her, by the way, <laughs> not Charlotte. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, yeah. Oh my gosh, that was so much fun, but tiring. You can probably tell how tiring it was by how red my face is. I mean, I kind of make it tiring for myself. I'm really competitive, so I just run loads when we're doing just like tiny practices and I get myself really out of breath. Anyway, I'm trying to revive myself. I'm gonna have a shower and then 
I don't know, I literally don't think I can do anything for the rest of the day. I have completely worn myself out. Oh, Sorry, after football, I got in the shower, then kind of died in bed, got up for supper, which was inedible, by the way. I had to have Weetabix. Now that's when you know it's bad. Anyway, I'm so tired now, so I'm going to go to sleep. I've just got back from lessons. My day has actually been quite up and down. So it started quite well. I mean, I woke up naturally very early and had this weird urge to tidy my room. So now my room's all clean, which is good. But then I didn't realise lessons on a Wednesday started earlier. So I was quite late to my lesson, but that didn't really matter. What mattered was that I walked to school and it poured with rain and I just got soaking. So I've literally just sat all day feeling really damp. And our school uniform, I don't know if you can see, but it's very like materially. So when it gets wet, it just smells like wet dog. It's kind of vile. But I actually need to get changed because it's lunch in two minutes and I'm not going down smelling like this. I don't know why we've just had another fire alarm. I think it was a test around, but it's weird because literally the two times that I've showed you a week, we've had a fire alarm. It's a very strange coincidence. Anyway, I've got CCF now. CCF, it's like these activities, it's cadets. Look, I'm really bad at explaining it. I try and explain it in every video, but I just can't. I feel like most people know what cadets is and that's what we call CCF. And yeah, I really can't be late, so I'm gonna have to go. Because if you're late, they publicly humiliate you. They literally scream in front of everyone that you're late and that you have to go and see them the next morning. It's actually quite embarrassing. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I have had the busiest day. So I got back from CCF, which was actually quite a bit of fun. Then I went for my corona test, which was not so much fun. And now I'm going to the gym. You're probably thinking, why are you going to the gym if you're tired? And now this is my problem. I'm meant to go twice a week for sports scholars and I've been once this year. And my new year's resolution was to stop being so lazy and to actually go to sports scholars. But that's not really happened so far. To be fair, even though it is March, I've only just come back to school. So technically I'm gonna start my new year's resolution today. <laughs> My body seriously hurts. I don't know what's happened to me. I used to be able to do loads of exercise and not feel a thing. I played football once, went to the gym once, and I feel like I've been hit by a truck. Apart from that though, I've had quite a good day. I feel very productive. I've done loads and I've not actually done loads in a day for ages. So I'm quite pleased with myself. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm buttoning up my shirts because it's laundry tomorrow. And if you don't button them up, they don't get washed. I literally cannot describe how excited I am to get into that bed. Very nice. Hi, Zogus. I don't think Vlogmas. <laughs> I don't think this is my girl. We're in a PR now, and I decided that after my productive day yesterday, I'm watching TV. So we're sat on the sofa. Okay, I'll be quick. I need to go to football now, but I just thought I'd mention our lunch. It was really delicious. We had this ciabatta with like chicken and vegetables on, and it kind of resembled Domino's in my opinion. Alice doesn't think so. No. But I actually think it does. I mean, I haven't had a Domino's pizza in about five years, but I don't know, just the sight of it, I was like, hmm, that looks like a Domino's. Anyway, I actually need to go because I'm running late. Football was actually a lot of fun. I've decided I really like it. I used to not like it because it hurts your feet. But then I was like, right, clue up, man up. And now it's quite fun. I'm just waiting now for Rose to get ready because we're going to the social space. I know it's a stupid name, but I don't want to complain about it because it's actually really nice of the school to give it to us. It's this room in the sports hall where my year allowed to go and socialize and there's a cafe. And yeah, we literally just go sit there and chat. I know that doesn't sound that nice, but in the situation we're in, it's like the best thing possible. So it is pretty nice. <laughs> <laughs> I had quite a nice evening actually, well afternoon and evening, so the social space was fun. Can you please think of some alternatives of what I can call this place? Because we were actually speaking about it at supper and none of us could come up with any alternatives and I am not going to carry on calling it the social space because every time I say it, it just, it gives me the ick. You know what else gave me the ick actually? We were at supper and we had tomato pasta, forget the whole tomato pasta around your face thing, like I don't really mind about that. I just leant over and put my arm in someone else's pasta sauce. It went all over my hand and on my scrunchie. Where is it? There. I don't know if you can see, I've been scrubbing it for ages, but it literally went everywhere and ugh. 
it was just disgusting anyway i need to go to bed and actually go to sleep because this whole week i've been like oh i'm gonna get into bed early and go to sleep early and i just don't so tonight i'm going to bed early this is a very rare occurrence i'm completely ready for school and i've got 10 minutes until my tutorial and to be honest i don't actually know what to do with myself because this really doesn't happen very often i'm just sat by my desk kind of staring into space it's a bit of a weird feeling to be honest i mean i've got a pot of granola because after breakfast i just i don't know it's happened every day this week i have breakfast and i'm like oh my gosh i need more of that and oh i don't know how to describe it it's kind of like crunchy nut but it doesn't have nuts in so i guess it's not like crunchy nut but do you know what i mean imagine crunchy nut without the nuts and you've got this you know what when i find out where it's from i'll tell you morning morning Samuna. pleased to hear because you can't be here morning everyone so i'm on my way to school three other people in my house do economics and they all left me so i'm just alone isn't that a bit rude? I'm not gonna lie, my day has been pretty standard. Fridays are kind of like Mondays, so we've just got loads of lessons. Actually, this afternoon's a bit different. We've got this thing called a sick form lecture, so you go and listen to a presentation, but obviously the speaker can't come in, so it's over a Zoom call, and mm, they're okay. Actually, most of them are pretty boring. Anyway, I actually need to go because lunch started five minutes ago. I'm not really too sure how to feel about lunch. Obviously, it's fish and chips because it's Friday. Usually, we get given cod or scampi, which is really nice, but today we're getting hake. And I've never heard of Hake before, so I'm not really too sure how I feel. The Hake? No. The talk, though, was actually pretty interesting. Anyway, I'm getting into bed now. I am so tired. I literally forgot how tiring school was over lockdown. And oh my gosh, this week I have just been hit hard. I'm not going to be bringing you along this weekend because I'm planning on sleeping literally the whole weekend. I mean, I do have lessons tomorrow and I'm going to have to work on Sunday because I've got loads of tests next week. But when I'm not working, I am going to be sleeping. But I'll see you soon. <laughs>